I'd like to talk about adding wellness to your fitness. Now everybody knows when you do fitness exercise, whether you're jogging or swimming or rowing or tennis or basketball or baseball, whatever the fitness activities you like to do, those develop your external immune system. Those are muscle groups on the back of your neck and head and shoulders that go down the back of your arms. And that's associated, that kind of fitness is associated with your external immune system. Your external immune system in traditional Chinese medicine is associated with your skin and with the lymph flow in your body that all goes from all the appendages up towards your heart. So the more fit you are, the more your external immune system protects you from outside things coming in that wouldn't be good to come in to your system. But that's not wellness, that's fitness. Wellness is associated with your internal immune system. Most people don't know there are two immune systems, an external immune system and an internal immune. The internal immune is associated with your tonsils, your thymus, and half the function of your spleen. And those together form an organ that does a particular function, internal immune function, and those are associated with your lymph nodes in your body, not your lymph flow. And your internal immune system is the part that fights viruses and illness inside of your body. And so the internal immune system is one of the most important systems in your whole body. There are two ways to affect your internal immune health. One is by eating nutrient dense, organic, the freshest food you can eat in your body. And the second is by doing natural stretching that actually helps your body to turn on your internal immune system. So there are many cases where people are very fit but not very well. Or a person being, can be quite well but not very fit. So you need both of those things. But in America and across the world, most people are thinking fitness is wellness instead of adding wellness to your fitness routine. So if you spend 15, 20 minutes a day doing natural stretches, resistance flexibility, where you let your muscles naturally contract when you elongate them, and you do different muscle groups in your body that you carry chronic tenseness or tightness in, then you can start to increase your wellness of your body or your internal immune. Like your external immune system, your internal immune system is also located in muscle groups from the crown of your eyebrows over the back of your head to the nape of your neck, down the outside back of your shoulders, down the back of your arms, into your hands. There are very different stretches that are associated with your external immune and your internal immune. Let's all get more well. Just feels much better. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. How's that? That's great.